What's up, what's up, what's up, everybody? This your boy. Oh, hold on, wait. Correction. What's up, everybody? This is yours truly, Myron <laughs> oh, from TheMyronMyron.com. See, um, I was inspired oh, during Black History Month, and no. I listened to my boy Marlon at CMU, and he was like, why we always say your boy? I'm a grown-ass man. <laughs> so, from now on, it's yours truly, Myron from TheMyronMyron.com, and on side of me, as always, it's the beautiful and talented and lovely on occasion. Uh, on all occasions, Cash. Cash, and we are back. Sorry we missed the week, folks. Excuse you. Um, Today's my birthday. Well, yeah, today's my birthday. What? My birthday. Uh, hello. You just want to dive right on in. We're not going to announce that it's my birthday. Happy birthday, Cash. That's just not hey, enthusiastic it's at um, all. I think. At all. <laughs> I guess. Uh, it's Cash's birthday, so we're excited that it is Cash's birthday. Uh, but I do think we need to start off the show because this episode specifically is... Yeah, I miss your past. I don't know your past code. This episode it's specifically really uh, is dedicated to black entertainment television. So I thought it would Not be... Not BET, though. Right. I thought it would be <laughs> appropriate to start the show off with um, a TV fact about our... About our queens and kings. Cash, what does that say? Oh, I don't read it. Oh, okay, baby. You can read Glasses and metal. That's true. All right. In 1939, <laughs> Ethel Waters became the first African American to star in her own television show. If you didn't know, shout out to Ethel Waters. In 1940, Hattie McDonald becomes the first African American to win an Academy Award. You see the lights got dim when we're talking about these black queens. All right. And one more, 1956, Nat King Cole became the first African American to host a nationwide show. So we salute all our black kings and queens yes. making that impact. Pioneers. For television and black, basically black entertainment television, um, and we're talking about that this show, but no, B E T. No, to we're, an we're, to an this isn't dedicated to B E T. Yeah, it's just this is dedicated to <laughs> black entertainment television. <laughs> Two I'm, completely different things. I don't know because I feel like back in the day we had one hundred six and Park, we had Rap City, we had B E T. We Uncut, had B E T. Now, Uncut, which was my favorite. Uncut. And I feel like that represented us. You just well. wanted to see the tip drill. Video. Yes, you definitely did. That's why I use a credit card today. Um, but anyways, uh, nice. recommendations this week, Cash. I think you should go first. I have to take a step out real quick. Hold on. Come on, Cash. Okay, your my recommendation is two things. One, everybody tell me happy birthday on Instagram or Twitter. Don't DM me. Just comment. Two, everybody, if you haven't seen Black Panther yet, go see it or go see it two or three times like I am also doing. Third recommendation, since mine still ain't back. Oh, I started a new show <laughs> on Netflix called Grace and Frankie. I'm late to the game, but it's a good-ass show with Jane Fonda and Lily Tomlin. And Happy birthday <laughs> to you. <laughs> Happy birthday what? to you. What? Happy birthday to you. Oh, God, don't sing. Wait, can I push you on my step? It ain't your birthday yet right now, but it is on the show. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Let me cover this receipt so you don't see how much you I'm hitting the cheap-ass line. You birthday so. So Cash thought I forgot about her birthday, y'all. And I try I didn't want her to mention it during the beginning of the show. But I, she ruined it. I'm gonna mention my I birthday. was getting there if you would have waited. Uh <laughs> so for Cash's birthday, I decided to hook us up with some hook cupcakes. Us? Yeah, I mean, I was like, why not give me a cupcake too? What? Um, <laughs> you mean hook me up? So hook her up. Hold it, hold the wine glass back. It's cheap, but it's gonna be good. Um what? so I had to hook up with some cupcakes. Ooh, and in the meantime, Right, you know us niggas on the drink, Scott. Uh <laughs> decided to hook us up with some drink. Um, and I decided to give us uh, some cupcakes for the show. So Are happy we birthday! This while we record, nigga. Yes, that's why I got it. That's why I got it. Be tipsy. All I had was some bread. Oh uh, well, you better. <laughs> All I had was two Bob Toast from Canes. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, Trey. You know what? Trey, We're you, gonna uh, bring you some honey. Sometime. Can't tell you when. And you can also have some of this Moscato. Uh, but anyways, <laughs> recommendations, Cash. While we pull up, I'll go ahead and give mine. Please, cause I gave three. I know. Um, okay, so my, nails are my recommendation, or I'm gonna open this. All right, <laughs> my recommendation for this week, and I think Cash, I think you can agree with this, right? Let me pull your little sub sub. Yes. Why, uh, why I say this? Together. My recommendation for this week is say what you mean, and read what you 
what you say. And mean what you say. Cash, can you agree with that? I feel like you about to take it somewhere it's not supposed to go. Oh, but God sure. Dang. Okay, so we agree. Say what you mean. Mean what you say. And I say that. Put this word on me. I say that good. for. Mm, it's cheap, too. <laughs> I say that for this, Cash. I was in the club on Saturday. Okay. And as I was in the club, a popular song came on. I'm going to sit the bottle of Moscato down at this moment. Set it off by Boosie. No. So, as I'm in the club, a song comes on, and I see a beautiful, a couple beautiful young ladies recite these words. Cardi B. Put that dick in my face. What? Let me see how it tastes. What song is that? Uh, what's the rest of the song? What? I don't, I don't know uh, that. If it tastes like, and then the following words said, if it tastes like water, I'm going to suck I it in water. I have never now, heard. Now, please. I know a lot of you have heard this song by Reedy uh, in New Orleans. It's, it's about, about song. song. It's oh, about no song. Wonder, Jesus. Now, I, as I saw the beautiful lady, beautiful lady singing this song, and I just said, I, in my mind, do you mean it? No. If I really put my dick in your face. No. Would you see how see, it this tastes? Is why I knew and I would go. And you know left. what? I knew the answer. Probably not. First oh of all, God. that's kind of creepy for a nigga just whipping his dick out and putting it in your face. I'm not in Hollywood. I ain't supposed to do that shit yet. Um, <laughs> <laughs> never. I'm not going to do it ever. Nice. Um, but more importantly, if you don't mean that, don't say it. In certain songs. It's a lot of songs y'all niggas rap that y'all don't mean either. But I personally it's always be like, uh, okay, give me an example. Any song by Level where he talking about he got dumb dick. Y'all niggas ain't got no dumb dick. But you're more likely to have dumb dick than to say. 4.0 GPA ass dick. Why is it doing I had, to, I had to think about that. I, I, was, I, was, I was like, wait, what point? No, I was like, ain't that good, nigga? But I, I get what you're saying. <laughs> um, but I, I, I agree with what you're saying there, Cash. But, you know, like on the songs, uh, you want to talk. No, I do that. You want to run your mouth. Uh, what's the you song? You ain't about to pull up outside nobody's house. But see, I always say there are no songs really not about their life. I always mutter it under my breath. But I say it because I know I'm not really about that. But... Again, you ladies, say what you mean, stuff. mean what you say. If you say, I put say that dick in I your mean, face no. and let you see how it tastes, see, don't be shocked re- when a nigga I'm do it. I'm not going to recite the lyrics. That's no. why I fuck with dreams and nightmares by Meek Mill. You like Trina? Yeah. I'm pretty sure you said something of that magnitude. No. Um, but anyways, I, again, and also I apologize, Queens. I don't think <laughs> nobody, I, first of all, I want to make, make this clear. I don't think no guy should just whip it out in your face and just assume that you're going to see how it tastes. I don't feel that way. But I'm gonna shut up. Know? Um, what what else we got to talk about this later? We drink some new wine. We're talking about black entertainment television later on. Oh, but we got our uh, you, you, I know, I know, you damn show. A... You're not gonna miss my favorite part of the show. Uh, that's why I was just about to ask you. Here we go, you. yo. Oh, here we go, yo. So what's the what's the what's the scenario? Uh, here, oh, this wine kind of good. Here we go, yo. <laughs> so what's the what's the what's the scenario? You know, catch okay. no fish. Okay. Uh, all right. Mm, take a little more sip. <laughs> Mm. Mm. Anyways, uh, and don't worry, y'all have uh, Trey has some plastic cups. Y'all couldn't be bougie like us. Uh, shout out to our guests coming on the show. Y'all couldn't be bougie like us. I mean, I I, I was he being only cheap. bought two glasses. Yeah, I was being cheap. I don't know. Why. I only had two dollars in my wallet. I didn't feel like using. So my you card. bought these? I, w- I hadn't seen a chip drill video in a while, what? so I wasn't inspired to use my card. So I used the two dollars and change I had. I did buy these dollar stones. Take some nice glasses. glasses. You can get some nice decor for your house at the Dollar Tree. Glass. Yeah, no, keep it. You can get some nice, this is another recommendation. Get you some nice decor for your house at the Dollar Tree. No, no. Go to Home uh, Goods or Target. Or the Dollar Tree. Nigga, these some nice, you just said there's some nice glass and you're going to keep it. It was a dollar. Anyway, um, <laughs> so the, the, uh, the scenario for this week, Cash, is the good old one got to go. Oh, God. All right, and I was going to make this more to your favor, but I'm not. Why? One gotta go cash, and I'm gonna give you three options. I feel like you're gonna make it easier. Martin, the Jamie Foxx show, and the Fresh Prince. Fresh Prince. Why? Because I love the Jamie Foxx show. I actually own all of the seasons, and Martin would never not be funny. Mm -hmm. You know, I love the Fresh Prince. I had a crush on him when I used to watch that show. Still kind of do. I feel like I'm pretty sure you follow that new (laughs) But... I mean, who doesn't follow Will? Oh, right. Who doesn't follow Will on Instagram? But... I could I could go without the French Prince. You know what I'm saying? 
Yeah. I can't go without more, and I can't go without the Jamie Foxx show. You know which one I'm going to pick? Which one I'm going to pick, Ashley? You know. Jamie Foxx show? Nope, I'm picking Martin. You will get rid of Martin. Yeah. I, I, I love Martin, but I never was the huge, I got to watch Martin. I gotta see it. Like I yeah, just I'm gotta not a, see I gotta it, so. see it in person, but it, it's very entertaining. I wouldn't get rid of it. Okay, I'll take that. Um, but it's a lot of people probably pulling a black card for saying you get definitely rid of is. Uh, we, you know what, you know what? I'm gonna take a little more sips because I was about to get into what we're gonna talk about first, and we're gonna we're gonna talk about. Um, I was gonna say Black History Month. We talked about that a little <laughs> bit. It show. still is Black History Month. It is. Uh, I don't like the fact how they, and you know what, I will say this. Somebody who shoots their shot at you in my inbox what is after, every, ever, after every episode, they say Wait, I get off. Wait, they shoot their shot at, at you? No, they what? shoot their shot at you via my inbox every episode. Um, oh, God. After every episode. But they if say I get off. If you know Myron, I don't want to talk to you. They say if I get off. you're related to Myron in any capacity. If you're in a fraternity the same as Myron in any capacity. If you're a part of Musa in any capacity. Oh, well, um, they're out. <laughs> if you've known Myron for wait, more wait, than wait, 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 wait. The way you're saying that is like I hang out with bad people. I'm not I saying, have real quality friends. But you be trying to vet people for me, and it never works. Oh, I'm never. I, I, <laughs> stopped, I stopped now. I'm never putting none of my friends on nobody Never introduced I'm never doing it. Anybody. One resulted in somebody having a baby. Another what? one resulted in oh, the person being... Oh, clarify, it's not talking about me. I mean, clearly, Cash. That's yeah, <laughs> something I don't know. Okay, so <laughs> somebody is. had a... A child out of wedlock. But see, I told... No, it was a blessing. Yeah. Let's go there. Yeah, it wasn't a child, it was a blessing. They're little gifts from God. Right. Now, that blessing could have <laughs> came at a later date had they listened at to a, my advice planned, after they... planned date. Um, yeah. But anyways, uh, yeah, I'm not... Oh, yeah, gonna, don't shoot your shot at me through mine. Because I'm telling you now, he never tells me. So... <laughs> <laughs> Your message is no. stand in my inbox and it doesn't go any further. Because you see what you just said, that whole soliloquy of me not. Exactly. So it's kind of pointless of me uh, telling you. Exactly. And don't DM me either. Shoot your shot, niggas. Don't do um, it. But uh, we're going to take a quick break and we're going to talk about. Wakanda. Yeah, we're talking about Black Panther first. Fuck y'all. We'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> 